My name is Stephanie Arney. I graduated from SDSU in 2005. I am now the conservation director at the Great Plains Zoo and Butterfly House and Aquarium. I just came back after being gone for 17 years using the skill set that I did learn at SDSU. My degree was actually a kind of a mix of psychology and human development. I remember loving that there was a diverse amount of programs and I wanted to do all of them. I was a cheerleader for Go Jacks. I loved the community. I loved the school pride. I just loved going there, it was fun. Fall of my senior year, I saw an animal show that existed at that time. They were filming behind the scenes at a zoo and they had an education department. And from that moment on, I'm like, oh my gosh, wait, I can mix my passion for biology and for psychology and communication and PR, all that, by working at a zoo in their education department. I applied for an internship at Omaha's Henry Dorley Zoo and I was accepted the study abroad program at SDSU. I actually got to go to Africa, which was an outstanding spotlight in my career because it really did change what I wanted to do with my career and it changed my perspective. When I got back from that study abroad trip in May, walked across the stage and from that point forward, I was full on into working in zoological facilities around the world. All of this was helping me become a well-rounded wildlife conservationist that not only can do the work hands-on out in the field, but can translate it to the public. I want to help people better understand animals. It's the passion and experience and the storytelling that I bring to the table. When I came here, I was thrilled about contributing any of my knowledge and expertise to my home state zoo. Here at the Great Plains Zoo and Butterfly House and Aquarium, we are working on three local species, our endangered Dakota skipper butterflies, our black-footed ferrets and American bison. We're really putting a lot of effort into protecting our local species right here in our backyard and our prairies. I have done hundreds of media appearances and they're all my favorite. They're so much fun to do. But the ones that stand out were the Drew Barrymore Show, my very first time on the Harry Connick Jr. Show. For me to be able to get, whether it's on a local news station or on a national station, you can reach hundreds of thousands, if not millions more people that maybe haven't heard these messages before. I got to have my dream career at a very young age and it just keeps getting better and better.